Winifred Brennan is a woman from Tubbercurry, Ireland, who was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's disease at the age of 62. She works tirelessly to advocate for her rights and the rights of others with dementia and Alzheimer's, encouraging others to use their voices to advocate for themselves. Life is hard work if you want it to be, really. There's a great saying, misery is optional. I don't want to be miserable. I want to work hard at trying to live as good as I can. And so I have to work with the strategies to do whatever it takes to give me a quality of life and to give those around me a quality of life. I want to give people who have just gotten a diagnosis hope. Hope that you can have a quality of life that isn't the end. It's not a death sentence. Yes, it's difficult. Yes, it's extremely difficult to not remember what happened yesterday. Then maybe it wasn't that important. But it's just to give people hope, to see that we can get up, we can get out, we can move, we can do most of the things we did before with strategies. We have to have strategies. And that is one of the things that I want to get out to people, that we can get on with our lives, that it's as simple as a diary. It's as simple as baking. It's as simple as doing your driving assessment or going for a walk or getting into your garden or doing whatever you did. If you play golf, we must encourage people to continue to play golf. If you play tennis, if you play bridge, Whatever you did in your life beforehand, try to get your friends to help you to continue doing those things. But in the meantime, when you're diagnosed, just do what you've been doing. I joined a ladies' group and we're all very busy knitting and sewing, and I'm afraid I'm not a knitter or a sewer. But that was good fun, good conversations. I think it's about getting out of there getting out of the darkness. That's what's really important. You can be very independent and can live with it. Absolutely, I live with it. Every day is not easy, but I actually enjoy my life. I enjoy it. It's my Alzheimer's life. It's not the end of the world. It's to be lived. I try and enjoy every moment of it. I think that's really important. Because I'm so passionate about rights and really being fully integrated into the community, I do not believe that we should have special aisles for me, or that I should be treated specially. There's nothing special about me. I'm just the same as everybody else. And so, I am not a lover of dementia-friendly communities, because I don't see a diabetic-friendly community. I don't see a Parkinson's-friendly community. I don't see a multiple sclerosis friendly community. I see an inclusive community. And I want to be included in my community, no label. I want to be fully integrated into the communities that I live in. And I think that we must stop treating ourselves as special. Yes, we have a hidden disability, but then there are loads of other hidden disabilities and there's nothing special for them. And whilst I appreciate people having a very strong view on a friendly community, it's not for me. It's about total integration, and it's really about my community adjusting to me, not me adjusting to my community. <laughs>